movie planes, what's a better way to convince your wife to travel by car than a true story documentary? Well, this movie is not your regular green screen and CGI usuals, the techniques used are shockingly ahead of its time. Let's get into it. The makeup team behind Society of the Snow is getting a lot of buzz, with eyes on the Goyas and Oscars. The film, directed by J. A. Bayona, tells the story of 16 men who survived a plane crash in the Andes in 1972. The team, including sisters Anna and Belen Lopez Pusherva, David Marti, and Montse Ribe, faced the challenge of making everything look real. David Marti wasn't initially excited about working on the film. He and Montse Ribe had already worked with Bayona on The Impossible and A Monster Calls, and he was hoping for something lighter. But when Bayona pitched Society of the Snow, he couldn't say no. The team had to dive deep into the history of the 1972 crash, using medical reports and survivor accounts to recreate the look of the survivors and the dead. They made hyper-realistic replicas of bodies, torsos, severed heads, and more. One of the most satisfying moments for Ribe was hearing the audience's reaction to their work during a crucial scene in a Chilean hospital. The film had the potential to be very graphic, but Bayona decided to tone it down. Marty recalls that they shot a lot of intense scenes, but many didn't make the final cut, because Bayona found them unbearable to watch. Rebe explains that the film aimed to be realistic, but also respectful of the survivors' experiences. Ana Lopez Puigcherva, who joined the project through producer Sandra Hamida, focused on the non-technical side of the makeup. Her tasks included ensuring continuity, depicting physical deterioration, and recreating the survivors' hairstyles. She even contacted survivors and their families for details. One of the toughest parts was showing the passage of time and its effects on the bodies. Lopez Puigserva used medical reports and interviews to ensure accuracy, such as the symmetrical bruising on a coma-stricken survivor's eyes. The team didn't expect the Oscar nomination. Lopez Pigserva is looking forward to her red carpet debut, with stylists already offering to dress her. Despite the buzz, she plans to stick with local designers and her friends in wardrobe for help. The behind-the-scenes work on Society of the Snow highlights the dedication and creativity that goes into making a film feel real. From the intricate makeup to the detailed research, the team's hard work paid off, making the survival story come to life on screen. <laughs> 